Welcome you back to Sanford Stadium and welcome Eric Zier to the broadcast booth. Eric uh, hey. makes an oh. he makes an hey. annual, uh, an annual <laughs> pilgrimage, pilgrimage, <laughs> an annual uh, uh, trick out of how he's going to show up late for this game every year. And today, boy, you really you really took the cake. And you but, and I'll bet there are a bunch of Georgia fans who were stuck today in the same mess that you were on ID five. But there is no question. How many years has Georgia beat Tech in a row now? A uh, whole lot. A whole lot. Six. So, yeah. so I, I'm just trying to keep up with that streak <laughs> on the number of consecutive years I'm late to this football game. Yeah, so it actually got up early today, left early, and then you're probably right, like thousands and thousands of other dog fans on 85 got tr- uh, stuck in some not moving traffic. So three and a half hours later, here I am, but late once again, and I've already heard it from Shivani coming in, I, and Scott Howard. It's just, we're little, I'm getting texts from Scott saying, you know, are you ever going to show up on time to this game? And, and I'm like, hey, you know, the, today's not the day. But it kept coming. Here's the good news for you. It's a shorter game today, so you only have about two more hours of crap than we're going <laughs> to That's right. That's right. It's, it's, it's much deserved. <laughs> much deserved. All right. Welcome, Z. Glad you got here safely. We're going to take a quick break, then come back. And we got a timeout with 6.54 to go. Uh, we kick, did we kick a field goal? I completely missed that. We were talking about t- shrubbery. <laughs> shrubbery? Or well, excuse me, we were talking about hedges. <laughs> we were. We were talking about the the hedges, and uh, the red team just broke the tie with a field goal. Peyton Woodring, 31-yard field goal. I apologize for not missing that, but we're just kind of hanging out in the press box up here on a glorious Saturday afternoon. All right, 6.54 to go. We'll come back for more of the G-Day contest here in the fourth quarter right after this on the Bulldog Sports Network. 